On August 13, 2018, Sarah Kozdat, along with her husband and two foster children, found themselves in a courtroom eager to complete the adoption process that would legally make her the mother of the two boys, as they anticipated the finalization of this significant step in their family's journey, an unexpected and heartwarming moment unfolded when Deshaun, the older of the two boys, chose to speak during the proceedings, leaving Sarah Kozad in tears of joy. For Sarah, the path to becoming a foster mom had begun at a young age. She had a deep-seated desire to provide love and care to children in need, and when she met Stuart Shank, her future husband, she wasted no time sharing her aspiration. The couple quickly fell in love and got married in 2014, setting their sights on fostering children. Initially, Sarah and Stuart had planned to foster newborns and toddlers on a short-term basis, considering their own young age. However, their journey took an unexpected turn when they were asked to take in a three-year-old boy named Michael for a weekend. What was meant to be a brief arrangement turned into a lasting commitment that extended for months and eventually years. During this time, a pivotal moment occurred when Michael was reunited with his brother, Deshaun. Witnessing the profound bond between the siblings convinced Sarah of the importance of keeping them together. Although Deshaun was older and initially outside of her preferred age range for fostering, Sarah connected with the teenager and decided to welcome him into their home. Sarah and Stuart had always maintained the goal of reuniting the children they fostered with their birth parents whenever possible. This commitment meant they had to navigate the ever-shifting plans for Michael and Deshaun, transitioning between preparations for reunification and adoption over the years. Amid the uncertainty, Sarah learned to be patient and cherish every moment spent with the boys, allowing the future to unfold naturally. Finally, on August 13, 2018, the family gathered in the courtroom to complete the adoption process. The emotions in the room were palpable. During the adoption proceedings, the judge asked if everyone agreed that the adoption should proceed. Deshaun's heartfelt response touched everyone present, as he confidently stated that everyone loved them. His words elicited laughter and joy in the courtroom, leaving Sarah Kozad deeply moved by this unexpected expression of love and affirmation from her foster son. Deshaun's heartfelt words continued to resonate in the courtroom as he expressed his profound love and gratitude for his new family. Through his tears of joy, he conveyed how much he cherished the Kozad Shank family, describing them as the best thing he had ever had in his life. His heartfelt sentiment left Sarah Kozad overwhelmed with emotion but deeply touched by his words. Deshaun went on to express that if he could have one wish, it would be to love his newfound family for the rest of his life. With these heartfelt words, the adoption proceeded as planned, marking a joyous moment in their lives. To celebrate this special occasion, Sarah Kozad and Stuart Shank hosted a celebratory gathering with their loved ones. Following the adoption, Michael and Deshaun officially took on Stuart Shank's last name. Deshaun also had the opportunity to choose a middle name for himself and decided on Star, a name that resonated with his unique personality. Sarah Kozad emphasized that Deshaun defied stereotypes associated with teenage boys, and she couldn't be prouder of him. With the adoption, their lives transformed while also remaining the same, as they were already a loving family before this official step. Many wondered if the couple would continue to foster children, and in September 2018, they were caring for a 14-year-old child. They were also in the process of receiving training to become foster parents for children who had experienced the trauma of sex trafficking. Sarah Kozad emphasized that their decision to foster wasn't about being amazing people or perfect parents, but rather addressing a heartbreaking reality. Many teenagers in vulnerable situations wait in social workers' offices or shelters for extended periods because there are too few homes open to them. Their specialized training aimed to provide support and care for these teenagers in need. For Sarah Kozad and Stuart Shank, there was no other path they'd consider. They believe that no child should feel grateful to have a loving family. It should be an unconditional given. Deshaun's courtroom wish had indeed come true, providing them all with a loving and forever family.